Kieran, another goal for you, but unfortunately ends in a 2-1 defeat today. Yeah, um, obviously I'm delighted to score again. Um, that's what I need to keep doing, keep scoring and helping the team out as much as possible. Um, but it weren't enough today for us and uh, we'll come away with no points again. First uh, half, you were 1-0 up at the break and all looked good, but to give them credit, they did come out strongly in the second half. Yeah, they're a good side. We always knew they were going to try and come back into it and... Uh, Unfortunately, we let them, but I thought first half, I thought we were excellent. I thought we dominated the game. Uh, I thought we deserved to be 1-0 up. Um, but you've got to do it for 90 minutes if you want to win football games, and we did today. You keep chipping away with the goals, and uh, it's nice to see somebody in the end of a bit of a scramble in the six-yard box getting the final touch like you did. Yeah, that's what that's what I've always done, to be honest. Uh, just getting the six-yard box, and it always falls to you at some point. Uh, and I was just happy to put it in the back of it. So second half, they come out, they hit the post twice. They get the goal, which unfortunately again was from a set piece, and that must be frustrating for you. Yeah, it's frustrating. Um, we've got some work to do on set pieces, I think. I think it's happened a couple of times, um, and unfortunately, you can't just keep giving them away or you lose football games. We could go to a lot of decisions. The first one, penalty for them, which Conor Ripley saved, looked a penalty. The second one, Jacob Beddow with the tackle. Did you have any thoughts on it? Uh, at the time, I thought he probably didn't have enough contact to, to go down and give a penalty, but we haven't looked back at that, um, so can't really comment on that. Um, there's another point in the game where Dylan's gone through, I played him through and he scored and he was onside, we've seen that back. Um, but obviously, you know what football's like, it's, it's part and parcel of the game and unfortunately we were on the wrong end of them decisions today. Yeah, you say kindly, part and parcel of the game, but it's happening quite a lot, isn't it, for you, unfortunately? Yeah, I think, I think we're just in that zone at the moment where things aren't falling for us. Uh, but hopefully with performances like the first half, we can take that into next week's game and hopefully things will start falling for us and we'll start picking up points. I think you saw from the reaction of the fans as you came off, they know that you put a great effort in today, the whole team. Yeah, yeah, I think they did and, and they've been excellent to be fair. Um, they keep backing us and that's what they've got to keep doing because um, we're going to need them this season um, and I thought they've been excellent so far. And how much are you learning from playing regular football at this level now? Yeah, learning as much as I can. Um, Obviously, I had regular football last season, but we were a league lower uh, and a bit out of position. So, to be playing up front uh, week in, week out, it's, it's really good for my development. And now, Bert and I have been away next week. We keep saying it, but it's another big game. Yeah, it's a massive game. Um, but hopefully, we can go there. If we play for 90 minutes like we played in the first half, I think we'll take all three points.